Good evening and welcome to your daily Idaho coronavirus update for April 15th. I'm Melissa Davlin. There are now 1,587 cases of COVID-19 in Idaho with a total of 41 deaths, according to the Idaho Department of Health and Welfare. The state has changed the way it tracks cases, counting both presumed cases and confirmed cases in its total count. So of those 1,587 cases, 80 are probable and the rest are confirmed with lab tests. On Wednesday, the state added one more death each in Twin Falls and Nez Perce counties. Also on Wednesday, Governor Brad Little extended his stay-at-home order through April 30th. The original order was set to expire today. That order now loosens restrictions for certain businesses, allowing some stores to reopen for curbside pickup or in-store shopping if store owners can operate safely with physical distancing. Other businesses, however, still can't open under the order. Those include places like salons, bars, event centers, and churches. Also, out-of-state visitors to Idaho will be required to self-quarantine for 14 days. Of note, the governor once again didn't say how or whether any of those orders would be enforced. We've posted a copy of the order on the Idaho Report's Facebook page. At the press conference, Governor Little also encouraged Idahoans to continue physical distancing and to wear face masks in public to reduce the spread of the virus. And remember, you can submit questions for Governor Little and Health and Welfare Director Dave Jepson on our website, idahoptv.org slash Idaho Reports. Our next live Q&A with them is Thursday at 8 p.m. Mountain Time. We'll see you back here tomorrow and until then, stay safe Idaho.